Right now, what I'm concerned about is having this hotel here. Uh, I think it would be great for the Yankees. It would be great for the Bronx. I think it would be great for Bar Mitzvah, 316 skis and Yeros. Uh, if so many people want to do conventions, whether they're in the clergy, whether they're educators, uh, and, and they want to do it with, with the interest of the borough, and yet they have to do it outside of the borough. It would be good for everybody. It would be good for the economy, the jobs. It brings everybody together. Plenty of jobs for everything. Just in my own area in Kingsbridge, major developments are about to take place on the old Stella Dora property and on 230th and Broadway. And all over the Bronx, this is happening. So I hope this hotel does go through because it will be a big boost for us, you know, turning us into almost a year-round business. The Yankees are starting to do year-round things. They're doing football games, they're doing concerts, they're doing non-baseball activities, and that really helps the community. With the success of the Metro North Station, Fewer people are actually parking in our garages, and we have a surplus of parking. So through the vision of the borough president and Marlene uh, with the BOEDC, they suggested that we repurpose one of the garages as a hotel. It is a wonderful idea. Over the years, I've had so many customers come and stay in Jersey City and Newark just because they couldn't afford Manhattan. Why not have them come and stay in the Bronx? It would not influence us at all. No, we stay Midtown and Queens. And just more action down there, safer. Our headquarters are just walking distance from here. We know that the borough president has the Bronx open for business, that he's making the right decisions, that the, the rest of the political community is behind him and supporting him, that he wants to do right by our residents. But I don't know if Ruben Diaz will be able to get it done. I hope he will. We saw what he's done for the Kingbridge Armory. We saw what he's done or not done throughout the Bronx in development. And I uh, just hope he's able to put it together. Because of the rezoning that already occurred on 161st Street and on the other side of the train station, fact of the matter is that the landlords have been waiting for something to happen. And this is what's happening. Now they understand that they can invest in their properties. Those people who have been sitting and waiting on key pieces of property are now going to invest because this has just added tremendous value. And one of the things that disappoints us the most about it is we support it, we're 100% for it. But they leave this parking garage closed because they're looking to sell it and not use it. So what it does, it hurts the businesses on River Avenue. Because people can no longer park there, they gotta go to other, the other side to park now, so it's been hurting the local businesses. We can move this community forward. We can bring amenities that are much needed. We can bring real career opportunities, job opportunities to this borough at a first-rate hotel in the borough of the Bronx will go a long way to helping people in my community as well uh, live a better life. Because if people go to work but at the end of the day they can't afford to move into the neighborhood, what good is it? Or if they have to live three families in one apartment, what good is it?